it strikes me that the jobs you're creating are jobs that probably never could be replaced by robots. Yeah, so it's a fascinating point you're making, and it's actually one I talked to someone about at lunch today, a yeah. mutual friend of ours. Um, so we're in a world where structurally some of the technology that we're creating is taking away millions of jobs. It will, right? But Honor actually very specifically is creating technology so that we can absorb those higher costs while we train people better, treat people better, pay people better, so that they're in a better place in their own lives, so that they then provide a better service, mm -hmm. which people will pay for, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And this is a service that is a human service. And the market, like, like we said, is going to double. And so we will absorb some number of truck drivers, right? right? And you know what? Some number of veterans. Right. And some number of people from the existing industry. But I actually see Honor as partially as a mechanism to be able to help folks who are being dislocated by technology. Instead, we're using technology to create more, better jobs. Right. And I think that more industries need to figure that out. Yeah. 